I am Salla Vijay Kumar. I'm a professor uh, of chemistry at the University of Connecticut. My primary interest uh, these days has been biological materials, meaning that making functional materials that can biodegrade. We are always trying to mimic the biology and try to do things under you know, simpler conditions of chemistry. Natural systems self-assemble, so in the lab we are able to self-assemble. If I have different kinds of molecules, I bring them all together and shake them up in a bottle, they recognize each other and sit next to each other in a preferred orientation, preferred order, predefined by the molecular properties, so we don't have to synthesize them or connect them. By assembling DNA, protein, and dye molecules, we are able to construct what is called a photosynthetic antenna system. The light harvesting complex in green plants uh, does the same thing. We want to make formic acid or hydrogen or something else for practical purposes. We have now built this four dye system that absorbs light in the blue, green, yellow, and red. Then all that coming out as red light and transfers all the excitation into one site where the reaction can take place. One purpose that we are thinking is to use that excitation energy to drive a chemical reaction, such as reduce carbon dioxide to formic acid, which can run a biofuel cell, so generate power. It's a reasonable path. We are not there yet, but that's, that's the thinking. We can use this red light to generate electrical power directly. So there are solar cells called Gretzel solar cells. And these cells work with titanium dioxide. It's also in the deep UV, so it doesn't use the visible light efficiently to produce power. So the power gain is low. Instead of using one dye, how about if we use our antenna system? Because this is now antenna absorbs in the green, red, yellow, everywhere, and transfers it to the red. Will that be any better or will it be any worse? Whatever materials we make, we want certain function to them, specific function. But at the same time, we want to make sure that they degrade, biodegrade, and uh, become food for something. 